Medical experts say that one of the contributing factors to increasing maternal mortality rates is lack of access to healthcare services before the emergence of COVID-19. With the pandemic in the picture, lots of women in the rural communities are finding it difficult to gain access to maternal services due to some certain numbers of reasons. So for later, a community of about 30 kilometers away from Kano Metropolis in Warawa local government area is one of the major settlements of producers of polythene bags in the states. At the community level, Tofar Leda has produced a local government chairman and prominent political leaders who have contributed a lot to the development of Kano State as a whole. Since it came into existence over 80 years ago, this community is saddened with the fact that it lacks health facility to cater for the well-being of expectant mothers. Magana taga siya muna siya muhala tapangarang asabuti. Bama da asabuti akusa. Gwede iki. Brashi laki ya tana kama maza muzi yomake. Laki ba mwede ita. Brashi yung asabuti awanda nyenki na mababani gaskia ba karamiza. Dan da da asubita aku sabar za aci za akai menteng za aku kerang kai suan garamba za iya barang ma agida mahai gua asubiting gida tu ba ba ada ma ba asubita agida si ni harum kata puat asubiting kapum zemong mahala ba ada ma ma magana was. Jangan yang menjadi cikin gadi asubitu metala kok menjadi asubitu dengan sungkuru. Saya kau makan tu aje, kerja chicken deli dan abang yang faru. Dia kerja anda sabun hawa dan aje ma. Entah ni aje, ini anda mau abang hawa kamu aje macam itu galah beta. Waktu mai terasa, ini terasa nanti aku kasih. Their plights worsened with the heavy weight of COVID-19 pandemic, as the closest healthcare facility for women is 10 kilometers away from the town, and they have to maneuver their ways through an unadopted road to get there. Ina na kuda ndani kavu mizo muto kwa asubuti, amashin ma wala ya kadoki, asubuti akadoki na akai na amashin, mna pata wana jiji ge jiji ge ngana kuda aga ina yungu ringa lwe na sio ifuto dakai, tarede ni, tu, mna tete pia haka harumu kapata dakati yangu wana jiji ge jiji ge, baada idhiri kusikia abo, tena sha wala, muka pata maati tu mashin ingi bam problem, tense dunzo na au nguri dapang. Ina zaune ina tena uda au lenna mtaani ma sana taka luna kuchia siri pukuska na nai. Kana ina mukti asubuti kilo mita ya kiti tala tunku arwai lahi tun karipi shabi na zua shabi darabi da izu seda mukaki. The services of a trained traditional bat attendants mostly is the situation. So let's get out. Anak day unguar, anak garis nang gaski abah buden si am putih cawan yang garis amasin. Antau kota, senam masa tuzo teh dua bah muteng. Jika cawan yang garis mewah bima muteng yang akan gui wazir ayu. Bazi asamudamar, baza asamudamar tau kan si, asubut betul yang akan gui wazir ayu. Tapi nara ada kimi muteng akan si asubut. Kuma bawa iwa ta unguar zuma cian itu oh buat. Ini mewari nanti aja kau anda dah aje tuti juarai, mesti dia cari tu kita orang jian dah tu zikir tu mak abu. Aku nanti aja itu orang kita, agar gajian sekian, bawa muda caza mani, wajah zat tu si orang macam tak faham lebu gaya dzat si gaya dzat. Members of the community said, despite their efforts in reaching out to the relevant authorities for years, their story still remains the same. As no change has taken effect. When you make a lot of time, come and come. As we tell you, come. Allah be kawa any man ba. Allah be kahi kala uku. Since you are the one who come, Allah be kawa suba. We tell you, come. Who the iron one? As we tell you, like it's a shakat. Any man? I got some mala mala chokwa there. When you must always answer the soji. I'm not a man. I'm not a baby. I'm a robot. I don't want to go to the store. Hold on, I can't work. I'm not a type of person. I'm not a man. 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 Dr. Mokhtar Gadanya, an associate professor at Bayer University, Kano, and a consultant public health physician with Amin Kano Teaching Hospital, said that a health facility is not supposed to exceed 5 kilometers as geographical access 
is a contributing factor to the increasing numbers of maternal and child deaths. The access forms, especially the distance and the time needed to walk to the facility is quite important because when facilities are far, people are less likely to utilize them or even when they do, they are less likely uh, to come back for any required laboratory or non-laboratory investigation, any required follow-up and they are less likely to report any experience side effect. So they are just likely to discontinue the medications. From pregnancy related causes are caused by three major or four major factors. One of which is delay in getting to the facility. The longer the facility is, the more delay you see between when emergencies are realized to when the emergencies reach a uh, facility. And for some emergencies, the services, uh, the care, medical care is supposed to be rendered within minutes. So if, for example, there is delay by several minutes, it's more likely going to lead to complications and even death. Attempts to have an audience with the chairman of the local government area, Al-Haji Yusuf Abdullahi and Lassan, on the issue of Tofar Leda proved abortive. However, there is still hope for the women of Tofar Leda, as the executive secretary, Kanu State's healthcare management board, Dr. Tijan Husseini, said that the board is carrying out a continuous community outreach program to render quality maternal services to expectant mothers and Tofer Leda is not excluded. Some of these mobile outreaches we provide, they provide some of this maternal care. Of course, a woman cannot um, deliver, say, under a shed or in a vehicle because the vehicle is not stationed 24 hours. Yes, we have such instances. And to address some of these issues, uh, we deployed what we call the uh, although we are using the american term uh, the motorbike ambulances uh, in short we call them mba uh, we deployed some of these vehicles they are uh, kind of tricycles uh, that a woman can be transported to the nearest health facilities although they are not also spread all over Kano, but again it's an ongoing intervention that we put in place over a period of time most of these 484 have um, a health facility. It may be a health post that is the two-room um, clinic uh, or a bigger space. But for where we have the required standard, is refurbishment we will do. Where they do not have, the government will construct. And we will deploy uh, the necessary manpower to cover these facilities uh, already. Uh, we've um, gotten approval, uh, the recruitment process has started to employ additional medical officers, doctors that will man uh, some of these facilities. We've gotten also approval to, uh, rec to recruit uh, the necessary staff um, to complement uh, and also to provide those services. So yes, we have a plan for Kano. Residents of Tofer Leda are hopeful that this time, their cries for help is going to bring about developmental changes in the community. Maria Muhammad Bawa, Solace Base TV.